Doris? Where are you? Welcome, Welcome Dr. Dr. Witch. Who are you? I am, I am the, the architect. This, this is, is where, where your quest, quest begins. begins. Your, your reality, reality, if you, you wish, wish to accept it. it. Your, your mission, mission to, to save, save the whole, whole of your, your universe. universe. Or else. Okay. That escalated. You have been accepted to a higher calling. Did you think of consulting me? I have a lot on. Activate anklets. Hey, what's this on my foot? The transmat ankles make you able to be transported to where we see fit. Is Dolores behind this? That, that will become, become clear in time. I'm usually very resistant to men telling me what I can do and where I can go, but for novelty's sake, let's say I go along with whatever this is. What's the end game? There, there are points in history and will be in the future, that have been ignored, left to be how they are, and that is unacceptable, and you will fix it. The universe is simply more than infinite, and it's not alone, but you will be, until the mission is completed. <sighs> Keep it vague, okay. Let's get this over and done with. Don't mind the bus. It will become confused and dangerous. As am I. It's getting closer, and unless you do as I command, all is lost. As we say here, no two ventures are the same. A different journey every time. Welcome aboard Caesar's Quest Travel. I can promise you this may be your first time with us, but it won't be your last. Papa. Quiet, you. I told you I want nothing coming out of that mouth of yours that ain't a show tune or a torch song. But, Papa, I'm tired. Do you want to walk? Because this bus will stop if I tell him to. You have a gift. Want to share with the world? You waste it on talking. But I don't want to be a singer. Little lady, I don't ever want to hear you say that again. And if you do say it again, it has to be sung. Even if I need the comfort room? That even more so. You can stand up and burst into a song that you're bursting for a leak on a bus full of strangers. You know you got something. Yeah, embarrassed. Pardon, honey? Embarrassed! Excuse me, miss. Are we uh, anywhere near getting home? How could we be? We're still moving! <laughs> hey! I wasn't asking you. But your face asked the question. Is ugly too small a word? <laughs> hey! Do you mind? No, but others might, so let's put a bag on your head. <laughs> Miss, can I, can I change seats? I'm sat next to someone who's trying to be funny. Oh, are you worried I might succeed? No, I'm worried you might not stop. Don't worry, sir. We are nearly at the end of our journey. Are we? Is that why we're slowing down? Really? We're not meant to be. To be honest, this mental omnibus is an old Christmas model. It runs on the goodwill of the passengers. Isn't there something you can do? You do work here. If you could be a lot nicer to each other, we could all get home quicker. I'll go chat to the driver. If that doesn't work, I'll get out and push. Or just get out. Hey, hey! See, it helps to have a sense of humour. No. Sid large at your service. Gags for hire or lower. I'm off to Butlin's auditioning. Meeting a funny guy, he says. Called Eddie Cannon. Gonna be a blast. Did I ask you for your backstory? No, but let me tell you the story of my back. <laughs> Fell through a window. <laughs> no, that was a pain. Pum! Hi! Hey! Excuse me, miss. Can I see your ticket? Ah, yes. Here it is. You're waving a tea towel at me. So, somewhere, someone's drying up a cup and saucer with my psychic sheet of A5. <laughs> Good luck with that. I will have to ask you to leave at the next stop. We're stopping anyway. We shouldn't be. The psychic bus is playing up again. Is it the model that runs on goodwill? Of the passengers, yes. Well, before you kick me off, I can inform you my speciality, the unknown. Let's have a look at the central brain hive. I could lock in my own mind and give it a mental kickstart. Could you? What else am I doing here? Hey! 
Get out! I'm trying to wake the beast and it's gone bogus. The mental receptors need to be realigned, and unless you've got those skills, leave me be or this will all blow. And that'll suck. This is well, a driver. Driver? I studied the transport margin mental seat reasoning ration belts for more years than you can count. You address me as Will D. Stallions. Destination, relocation, ion vector expert, level R. We haven't time for that. This lady says she can help us. Do what exactly? I arrived here not quite by my own decision. And to get home and find my friends, I know I must do this. Here we go. I just break out some like cable beyonders and set them to a power feed in my brain, for instance. And... Uh, right, I fixed their problem, such as it is. Can I go now? Hello? Architenda? You have done nothing, if not make matters worse. Look to your folly. What folly? It's fixed. Well... I must admit I was skeptical to you showing me up, but now I take my hat off to you. You're a miracle worker, lady. Should that engine panel be glowing and shaking like that? Not that much, no. Step back, what did you do? Nothing. Doesn't look like a whole lot of nothing to me. There's a face forming on the instrument panel. It's really a It can't be. How can I sell? Where shall we go? Don't answer. That's the leader of Lally's, an evil retail empire that I thought I thwarted. What's he doing in the central high focus of our bus? He'll be able to do anything he wants, and that's my job. I'm hoping he doesn't work that out. You see, it's not really him. It must be a fragment in a residual memory that has surfaced. In the bus mine. Uh, when I connected my mind. Don't mind the boss. Okay, I get it now. So, now what do I do? Best to keep this from the passengers. <laughs> At least we are moving now. Where are we going? When, when shall we stop? It's asking a lot of questions. Let's just hope it's content to be patient for the answers. Just no one unsettle it. Keep calm. Right. First, I want to know, what kind of place do you call this? Two, do you expect to put up with this? And three, down. It's killed him. You did this. My boss. I thought I was helping. You've turned my boss into a killer. What do we do? I... What shall we? So, this was your plan from the beginning. To wreck this bus. Not the witness. It knows me. I'm thinking we should leave this cabin and get where it is safe. Attention, passengers! Dive with bark from this mortal coil. The bus terminates here, as will you. That is all. Large, is that you? Have we met? I'm gonna forget a face. Now, I'm there, that's a different story. <laughs> Jokes still sound as ever. sad. Sid, can you sing? Put, Put your, your head between your, your legs and, and kiss your, your hand. Look at you. Goodbye. Will, Will you all die? die? I don't want to die. At least, maybe on stage or live on TV. Daddy! Sorry, why are you singing? You should apologize. You got a show from a superstar of the future. Hey, you there, lady. You started all this. Run right now. Get off. Hey, little girl, sing. Sing like our lives depend on it because it does. No freebies. But you said... Callista. Callista? Callista bomb? Buzz, don't kill us. We love you more than trucks and cars. You are trying to trick me! 
I will kill you. No. If ever a collection of passengers in a random vehicle loved a vehicle more than we love you, then it wouldn't be true. I'm sorry. You've confused me. Architect, why in the world of witchcraft did you take me out of there? I saved them, didn't I? Architenda? Where are you? Where have you put me now? Okay, it's time to pass that call, but the resistance has that question to have a body to die for. Oh no. Tell me you've not brought me here. Welcome, Doctor Witch. Welcome to Pilate Planet. Doctor Witch featured Melissa Stanton, Joe Scott Darrell, Connor Darrell, Mark Keegan, Tori Waddington, Kaz Johnson, Phil Stewart, and Dura Battaglia, Joseph Scholes, and introducing Lulu Miller. It was written by Elliot Stewart and is an Invisible Commissions production.